It was an afternoon treat for thousands of kids. For almost four years on WCOV, Captain Zumar and Saturna took their audience, both in the studio and at home, on a fantasy trip through the stars. The costumes were homemade, as was the set. It was made up of old lights, fans, and a vacuum cleaner to make the sound of a rocket engine. They really thought they were going to get in a spaceship. Yeah. <laughs> but some of them were very impressed, they, they you know. They sat on they benches. <laughs> we would have some once in a while. We would cry because <laughs> they heard all this racket and all that, and they saw the takeoff. You may remember the telecopter. It was used in public appearances around the area. Lots of kids got autographed pictures like this one and got a chance to join the Captain Zumar Club. What is your name, first of all? Alice McAnally. Alice McAnally, and how old are you, Alice? Nine. For an hour and a half weekday afternoons, the show used all the props and sound effects to entertain and sometimes educate kids about everything from the solar system to things about their town. Sometimes other contests backfired. One had kids crawling all over downtown to find a key hidden somewhere in or near a state building that would unlock a prize treasure chest. And then we proceeded to start giving clues. And eventually, of course, they all led to around the Capitol. Well, one day we got this call from some folks up at the Capitol. Please call all these kids off of here. They're driving us crazy. They're coming in. They're going everywhere in the Capitol. They're looking under the monuments. They're tearing up the bushes. <laughs> I said, what are they doing? What are they looking for? I said, well, we've got a key to hit. Well, tell them where it is for Pete's sake. But overall, most of it worked, and the kids sometimes learned something, or as with most kids' shows, walked away with a memory of their childhood. They may not remember my name, but they remember Captain Zumar. Till tomorrow, then, Captain Zumar and Saturna say so long for now. Bye. Greg Schieferstein, WSFA News 12, Montgomery.